How does metamorphism occur? Metamorphism is a geological process by which rocks undergo physical and chemical changes in response to changes in temperature, pressure, and chemical environment. Metamorphism can occur due to a variety of factors, such as burial deep within the Earth's crust, contact with hot magma, or compression due to tectonic forces. When rocks are subjected to high temperatures and pressures, their mineral components can undergo a process called recrystallization, in which the individual mineral grains become larger and more closely interlocked. This can result in a stronger and more durable rock formation. In addition, some minerals may break down and reform into new minerals, altering the chemical composition of the rock. Metamorphic rocks can be classified based on the degree of metamorphism they have undergone. Low-grade metamorphic rocks, such as slate and phyllite, have undergone relatively mild changes and still retain some of their original texture and mineralogy. High-grade metamorphic rocks, such as gneiss and schist, have undergone more extensive changes and are often highly foliated, with layers of minerals aligned in a parallel fashion. There are several types of metamorphism, each of which occurs under different conditions. Regional metamorphism occurs over a large area and is typically associated with the collision of tectonic plates. Contact metamorphism occurs when rocks come into contact with hot magma, resulting in localized changes. Hydrothermal metamorphism occurs when hot water circulates through rocks, altering their mineralogy and texture. Metamorphic rocks can provide valuable information about the history of the Earth's crust and the processes that have shaped it over time. For example, the presence of certain minerals can indicate the type of metamorphism that has occurred, while the alignment of mineral grains can provide clues about the direction and intensity of tectonic forces. Studying metamorphic rocks can also help geologists understand the processes that occur within the Earth's interior and the factors that contribute to plate tectonics, mountain building, and other geological phenomena. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications.